In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Sigma Excel to create an individual's chart for non-normal data. Specifically, I'm going to show you how to create an individual's chart with a Boxcox transformation. An important assumption for individual's charts is that the data be normally distributed, unlike the X-bar chart, which is robust to non-normality due to the central limit theorem. If the data is non-normal, the Boxcox transformation tool can be used to convert non-normal data to normal by applying a power transformation. The Johnson transformation and other distributions may also be used with automatic best fit. Now for this example, we are using the sample data called non-normal cycle time 2. You can find this sample data in the Sigma Excel installation directory. Now this particular data contains continuous non-normal data of process cycle time. We performed a process capability study with this data earlier in measure phase part H in the workbook. Now initially we will ignore the non-normality in the data and construct an individual's chart. So select the control chart option and select individuals. Make sure all of the data is selected and click next. Now select cycle time for your numeric data variable Y and make sure that test for special causes is selected and click on OK. And you'll see that the resulting chart clearly shows that the process is out of control, uh, but is it really? Non-normality can cause serious errors in the calculation of individual's chart control limits, triggering false alarms, which are type 1 errors, or misses, which are type 2 errors. We will now construct an individual's control chart for non-normal data. So click Sheet 1 of the data set, click on Control Charts, go down to Non-Normal, and select Individual's Non-Normal. Now once again we will select cycle time for our numeric data variable Y and we will select box Cox transformation with a rounded lambda. Now once again make sure that test for special causes is selected and click on OK. And the resulting control charts are produced and you can note that there are no out of control signals on the control charts so the signals observed earlier when normality was assumed were false alarms.